on the eggplant. Voila. Um, these are wonderful suggestions that I love to put on the eggplant. Is um, Either you can, let's see, it's wonderful because it has less acidity. It, as a matter of fact, it is very alkaline for the body. Goat milk, goat cheese, and you can purchase it where it comes in this shredded format, such as that. And what I like to do um, is put maybe half goat cheese on there on one on uh, one side of the wow. eggplant, and the other side. Flour, almond meal is so much healthier for you. So I sprinkle almond meal on there, and it gives it sort of a bread crumb texture. And you got that wonderful almond meal on there, which is a wonderful almond meal on there, which is a nut almond meal. It's just wonderful because it's got great texture, and you've got, these are like uh, almonds as well, but these are organic uh, raw, raw almonds, and that gives it a nice little coating too. You can put a little bit of that on the cheese, it won't hurt a thing. And, uh, okay, guys, which side do you like better? The almond or the goat cheese side? So we're going to scoot on over here to the oven. Okay, if uh, someone can get that oven for me. Now, if you watch out for you get stepped on. And we'll put that in right inside that lovely clean oven. It's been beautiful. Now, this would be great if this was one of those shows where you just pull it out and we got the other one that's ready, but we don't. <laughs> so, these are very good for you. They're very high in um, omega-3, and that's very good for you. Uh, we're going to cut this uh, avocado, and you take it along the perimeters of the skin, and you just kind of scoop that all the way around. And you add that to your salad. You see how that comes out nice and smooth? And then you get all the little yummies out of there. And if you want to, you can lick the spoon. <laughs> <laughs> I used to lick the cake spoon when I was a little girl. And not too long ago. But now I'm into health and I'm licking the avocado spoon. Thank you very much. <laughs> Um, some wonderful sea salt. Sea salt has so many minerals in it and your bo the body needs not only vitamins but minerals. So we're going to sprinkle a little bit of that on our um, salmon, wonderful salmon, which I've already put a little beet. And I sprinkled that on there. A little um, seasoning salt. Normally I'd put butter on it, but it's good to go. Don't have no lemons on hand, but we have to bake do. So here we go. Move over eggplant, you got company coming. Good thing you're not too hot, and I didn't put you in there too long ago. Now, got a little uh, salmon going. Normally I make a lot of salmon, a lot of things, you know, larger portions that'll last me throughout the week. And that way you don't have to cook all week long. Now, we're gonna take a break and pause for the cause, but we're gonna come back and we're gonna be making some chocolate balls. <laughs> I love them chocolate balls. And we make that out of cocoa powder. We make that out of um, any kind of nuts you want, like. Uh... <laughs> you can see that I'm uh, making some very thin carrots by just using the carrot utensil here to make very thin carrots. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, uh, I just wanted to contribute something. It's called a potato pillar. Oh, the potato pillar is what I'm using to trim the very thin carrot. Thank you very much. That's enough. I we're gonna back up here, take the, um, I took my hat off because I get hot in here and it's time to eat. Now, here's the, um, coming out, the beautiful salmon, first of all. Look at that wonderful salmon. Put that on top there. Then we'll move this out of the way. Ah, hot chatita, hot chatita. hot mama. Okay, we come out with this um, beautiful eggplant. Mmm, parmesan. Voila, is it a beautiful thing. Now, I'm on. let me tell you, I put half a side of this is just kale leaves. They're going to make wonderful crunchy treats when you're done. Little EVO uh, olive oil. And I put um, onion powder on one side, too, and sea salt. So we're going to see which one takes the best. That takes about 10 minutes. In the oven you go. And uh, I forgot to add this wonderful antioxidant seasoning called tamarack. So I'll just put a little bit on there now in my bag, and we're going to... You know, it's something like um, eggnog on top of. Oh, I love eggnog. Don't say eggnog. Anyway, cut. Ooh, 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 ooh. It's all